Warning! The following audio may contain coarse language and other material that may not be suitable for a younger audience. Listener discretion is advised. Also, we may spoil everything and anything, so you have been warned. So should I should I intro and then go Garnt first? Yeah, do it. <laughs> okay, sounds good. Do it now. Four glass again. <laughs> I'm thirsty. One second. Okay. <laughs> fucking, wow. Fucking chug 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 <clears throat> chug. <clears throat> no. Oh, that shit's like fire. Oh man. But anyway, um. Okay, so today we got Kotaku, <laughs> and um, we're all a little intoxicated today. It's and... fucking St. Patrick's Day, guys! Happy St. Patrick's Day! Hell yeah! What the fuck? It, uh, happy St. Patrick's... Happy late St. Patrick's Day, I should say. Yeah, because we're recording this on St. Patrick's Day, but... This may or... It's not St. Patrick's Day. It's not St. Patrick's Dude, Day. Dude, who knows when... Yeah, I yeah. hope this isn't St. Patrick's Day when this gets uploaded, because it's probably 2014 by then. <laughs> That'll be <laughs> sad if it takes that long. That'll be really sad. So, with me today, I have Garin from Gigik. You're from the Amazon, aren't you? It's actually, like, my real name is actually Garn, guys. I know it's hard oh, to believe, it's... but my real name is not Giga. Oh, it's hard to believe. <laughs> now we got Gene. Wait. Wait. No, wait, it's not Gigik. I know it. I have a mo- I know it. He told me once. <coughs> okay. Oh. Okay, so we got... Oh. Jesus. Um, <laughs> fuck. This, this we, is we gonna have... be the worst podcast ever. <laughs> this is gonna be... What the fuck? Right, 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 okay, okay. You... Guys, guys. What are you bitching about, Gene? <laughs> You're just like... Just... Oh my god. I don't want to deal with this. I did not come home after a long day at work for this, okay? So, if you could just... Be quiet. Everybody's doing weird things. Yeah, I don't know how I'm supposed things. to handle this. Everybody Man. chill. Just 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 fucking chill, guys. Just just We have Gene from X Disturbed Gene and Tristan from Glass Reflection. Yo. Not plural. Not plural. Wow. That's a big deal. Not plural. Not plural. Thank you for remembering that. Okay. And um so aside from the luck of the Irish getting to all of us today, I would like to ask Garin. What have you been watching recently? Hold well, on, two seconds. Luck of the Irish. Well, Do you know your history yep. at all? Okay. No, I have no fucking idea what St. Patrick's is all about. I do. Okay, okay, okay. I, I think it ha- right. Is it a Blarney Stone? Story time with Tristan, everyone. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, I'm not going to sit here and, and reiterate Irish history. Because you can all look it up on Come your on, own. Come on, Tristan, but you're so good at storytelling. No, Please. I don't want to listen to this. No, I don't want to listen to this either. Uh, I don't think anybody wants to listen to I this. I do. I, I don't think anyone and wants to And I don't want to tell it. it. Let's just say that Fine. Ireland is not very lucky in the history of the world. And leave yeah, it at that. Them, it's fucking snakes and shit. Fucking Indiana Jones would hate it, I bet. Um, so Do they even have, wait, what are those things called? Shamrocks or Forley Clovers? Is that the same term? They're the same. It's just, I think one's, one's yeah. just like, they a, are. I think they're both actually just considered Gene, weeds. Gene, Gene, you just fail as like, did you say you're half Irish? I, yes, I am. <laughs> You <laughs> fail. You fail so badly. I know. I don't know anything. Don't to know. all, to all the Irish people watching, I, I'm sorry. To yes, to all the Irish people watching, you guys fucking hate me already. So you can just hate me some more. Fair enough. <laughs> because and I don't fucking no shit. Done. And done. And done. I now significantly hate you more. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So Garrett, what have you been watching? I've been watching Go. Yeah. It's this dude. Go by is so good. Movie. This is movie. Okay, let me describe it. Loved it. Okay, because this, I think this is a perfect movie to dry, blah, 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 to describe when you're drunk. Yes, it's so okay. It's like what happens is it's a fucking horror movie by yep. Infotable. 
Yeah, and no, it's, it's what happened. It's UFO, UFO, ta- it's UFO table, remember? We, we saw that video. I saw a video <laughs> and it says it, so... It's you suck my dick, because I don't give a shit, mate! No, okay. <laughs> Holden, it's, let him speak. It's about, f- it's about fish. Holden. Holden. Holden, I... F- we what? know you like oceans. <laughs> we know Ocean. you like standing majestically next to oceans. Dude, that's... You know, shut the fuck up. I have profile pictures like that, actually. Oh, oh, really? Oh, Yo, I had no oh, idea. Oh, no Yo. fucking shit. It's real. Okay. So, Go is about what happens if these army of fish and sharks and all these aquatic life forms spring mechanical robot legs... And invade the land. But okay, it sounds like shit. They're not just fish and sharks. I love it already. They're not like sharks I love it and already. fish. They're not just sharks and fish. They're dead zombie sharks and fish. You've got to point that out. That they are not. Li- they are literally rotting corpses of fish and sharks that are now walking. Do their- they have laser beams attached to their heads? Uh, no. No, 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 no. They fart. Oh I'm yes, not. they fart <laughs> a lot. That's a big thing. And then it's uh, it's this thing where they can. Fart. Oh, that was such a fucking weird plot point, and they stink. So how how does UFO Table go from making Karno Kyokai, which is arguably one of the best written story things ever, and Phase Zero? I love both of those; they're really good. To fucking zombie mechanical uh, fish that fart. The thing is, okay, well, it's not a bad anime. I would like to point that out. I I, ha- I have a theory about this. Okay, yep. Because um, I have a theory. I have a theory that, a demon. that Ufortable is basically run by a bunch of Holdens. Yep, pretty much. <laughs> it, it is. No, no. The, the more uh, films I watch by them, the more I think it's just a bunch of people like me. That would explain Paradox Spiral and all those yeah. transitions. Yes, yes yeah. it would, wouldn't it? That would be, that's so true. So, like, like, my theory is what happened was, like, they just made Fate Zero. And then someone goes, because <laughs> Fate Zero is amazing, someone goes... I bet you, I bet you can't fucking make this look good. And they give them go the manga, and they fucking did. They, they handed the, the two volumes, of, yeah, the two volumes of I, of the manga of go to the the yeah. guy. And he's like, and then, and then, and then like, you're and then, fucking on, dude. Yeah, it's like fucking challenge accepted, guys. I'll fucking do this, and there's nothing you can do about it. And that's how second was made. best bet ever made in existence, dude. It's so what's the, good. What's, what's the first? Uh, wait, wait. What's the, what's the first best bet? Uh, the first bet is a bet that existed between George Lucas and Steven Spielberg on which movie would make more money: Star Wars or um, Close Encounters of the Third Kind. They both bet, f- I think, five percent of the profits to each movie to each other. And uh, Steven Spielberg has five percent of the profits to Star Wars because of it. Fuck me, man. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Best bet ever. And and you've just listened to another segment of Story Time with Tristan. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think uh, that the thing about this, I am full of weird facts that make no story sense. Story time with Tristan. <laughs> it's story time with me. You <coughs> and uh. you and me. <laughs> Is that a real song? No matter how we toss the dice, we'll always be the only ones for me. Yeah, whatever. Oh, I was hoping you oh would go God. on. I was gonna sing with you. Joe is so good. So happy I'm, together. I, I'm I'm good. We stopped. I'm good. We stopped. Can we move Fine. on? Ba, 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 so ba, guess what ba, I've been watching, guys. Ba, 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 no, we're not fucking done with Yo. Yo is fucking fine. Fucking Yo. Yeah, we're done with Yo. No, I have it's to fucking say- fish. I think we're done. Like fish no. with robotic legs that far no, and I want to say things that Garin will neglected to say. That is okay. the reason that is a bunch of people like me running around. <laughs> is it is a bunch of people that focus on the idea of beauty and everything about beauty and how everything has a certain degree of beauty to it. Who are just like, yeah, we can make this look beautiful. And the thing about it is that they actually achieved that really well. The anime looks really good. Uh, even the CG fish, you really get used to near the end. At first, Garn, I said it's pretty. pretty oh, fucking- you get used to the CG. Really? The, the CG's not even bad, though. That's the thing. It's None of it's I bad. I don't know. I don't believe you with that. Like, 
you you don't like CG no, period. That's, that's false. You you had so much to bash on on JoJo's Bizarre Adventure because of the CG in the opening. <laughs> in the opening. Well, don't bring that shit up again. And now you're no, saying that's... that you're getting used to the CG in No, Gio. that's totally different. That's... That's, that's not that's not a quicker turn off for Holden than CG. It's no. not fucking CG, man. No, that's that's different because that's only used once and that's not warranted to only use it in the opening. That's fucking stupid. Whereas this is used throughout the entire movie. It's totally warranted. If JoJo's had CG throughout it, I would say, yeah, fucking do it. Put it in the opening. But it doesn't, so it can't warrant it. Whereas Gyo has it throughout, so I'm letting it slide. But it looks really good. And it's just like fucking... It shows what it can... Like, CG can look good. Same with, like, Black Rock Shooter, the television show. The CG in it's better than the animation, I'd even say. It's just fucking... CG's getting better and better. Especially with Ami and Yuki Wolf Children... It, you can't even tell it's CG because they mount 2D images onto it and it looks fantabulous. And Wait, is it just me or is Holden talking really fucking fast? Uh, it's, it kind of is. Um, but it's right. I am the wrong person to ask for that because I come from Newfoundland where everybody talks a hell of a lot faster than the rest of the world. So he's talking normal, man. <laughs> Newfoundland. Uh, well, I, I thought he was talking really fast with Holden. But... Whoa, and Gigok, you're the one that usually talks super fast. So what is going on here? Oh, okay, no. no but super all I, fast. That's all I wanted to say. All I wanted to say is that the sh- it looks beautiful. That's all I wanted to say. I just want to, I just want to add one thing. Okay. Where, okay, I just want to say it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. No, it was fun. It was like High School of the Dead. The thing, the, the thing like... that made it good was, one, you could tell that passion, and they put effort into this project. Yeah, they put like, a lot of it. I remember talking to Tristan about the, the recent Mass Effect anime that came out. Oh my which, god. Oh, we yeah. can talk about that. We can move that. Oh, That'll okay. be a segue. We'll talk about that in a second. But, it's like, but you can finish which, first. But it's like, there was no passion at all put into god. that project. And it was shit because of that. But the thing about Gyo was that you can tell that there was passion put in this project. I liked and, Gyo. And, like, I can't hate it no matter how shit the story is. I just can't hate it just because you can tell that there's, there's been fucking... There's been effort put into this. It, like like yeah. I said, my, the only thing I can think is that is a bunch of Holdens going, fuck, I'll, I'll fucking show you what the fuck I can do, whatever the fuck I want. <laughs> because, yeah, I, <laughs> and then they say, oh, we fucking did it. <laughs> The fucking told you. No, I think the, the biggest thing about it is that it's like it goes to show that Studio UFO Table can make shit stories still watchable, be- just do it how beautiful they are. Like it, everything about it. Like I, not everything about it, but just everything that UFO Table was in charge of as far as animation, visuals, and like sound and stuff. The sound sounds great. Uh, the soundtrack's pretty good. It's just like everything that they were directly in charge of, aside from the script, is just pre-made. I thought it was fucking awesome. Like, if you put it to any other story than what it was, I think it could have been amazing. But that being said, I'd yeah. still say, Gene, I think you have to watch it because it looks... Yeah. It still looks really good. I don't know. Like, when you guys showed me the trailer, like, all I could think was, what no, no. the fuck? And it reminded no, me... No, no shit. Yeah. No, no shit. We, we watched we it. We went into it to make fun of it. Mm-hmm. We were... Yeah. And we were just like, we were gonna bash it. Wait, wait, this is this is fucking, this is alright. What the fuck is going on, guys? Yeah. <laughs> like, it reminded me of the girl who left through time because of the animation. And then it reminded me of, like, the Simpsons episode where the dolphins took over the world. <laughs> I don't Garn, know said this, Garn said the same thing about the, the, the left through time. He said that, yeah, the character designs look yeah, pretty Yeah, the similar. animation looks just like that. It's just, it's a really good looking anime. And that's when I was like, Ufotable yeah. did this? What? Yeah, Ufo Table did it. Ufo Table yeah. also yeah. did the Tales of yeah. Symphonia anime. Did not know that. Random fact. Yeah. With that said, though, Wait, random seriously? fact. Yes, they random did. Random fact. I love Tales of Symphonia so much. Yeah. Oh random fact. That game was like my Oprah when I was young. <laughs> my Oprah? Your Oprah? Yeah, that game. Wait, 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 wait. What the fuck? Your opera? Explain. What the fuck does that even yeah, mean? Yeah, what does that mean? That game was like so. <laughs> Like, it was like my life force. It was like my reason for being for the longest time. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. What, what does that have to do with Oprah? Yeah. I have no idea. It's a figure of speech that I stole from a show called Archer. <laughs> That's about it. I love Archer. It's so good. Oh, uh, okay. I was going to say. I love Archer. It's so fucking good. <laughs> Speaking of no soul, pe- so Mass Effect made an anime recently. It was funded. Danger Zone? Was it? May, was it funded by Funimation? I don't know the exact specifics. Yes, it was. It was, it was. I thought it was co-produced by Funimation. Yeah. Like, Funimation yeah. was like all over this thing. Between yeah. that and the Dragon Age anime, and it was just like... It, it made me wonder. I was like, okay, normally they're just licensors. For, so for them to be yeah. producing something 
They better like, not screw this okay. up. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Funimation is what Tristan said. No, no, okay, okay. I got, I, I got something to say. Funimation, if you listen to this, let's, let's, let's have heart, heart. Just, just, just you and me. Please keep in mind, okay. he's drunk. Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, shut the fuck. Don't listen to these twats because yeah. I don't know what the fuck they're talking about. Let, just you and me have a heart, heart. Funimation. You and me. Yeah, I love you as a company. You, you've given me so many good dubs, so many good shows. Uh oh. But please. Here we go. Don't produce anime. Just fucking license it and just give us it, okay? And dub it. I don't need another fucking Mass Effect because I love Mass Effect as a game. And this movie was fucking shit. I'm going to correct you there, okay? Well, not correct, but I'm going to interject here. Um, I'm fine with Funimation making, uh, helping to produce anime. What I'm not fine with is Funimation teaming up with another American company to drag some Japanese animation studio into making some show that they're not really that interested in doing. Yeah, because because that if if it's if it's a thing like Bones comes up saying, "Hey, we want to make this anime and we need some extra funds. Funimation, will you help us out?" Sure, go nuts. But you don't have like Funimation and Bioware going, "Hey, Production IG, make this shit for us." I doubt that's actually how it went, but... That's exactly how it went. That's what I imagine. I was going to say, that, that is exactly how it went, actually. <laughs> not, not, not. Uh, it was me. Funimation just, just had it. Because, well, that's what it felt like. Because, no, because, Garn, you watched that movie. You watched yeah, yeah. that film. Does that look anything to the quality of anything production has IG made no. before, like, since 1995? No, it doesn't. I, I w- what looks worse? Vampire, um, blood... Plus the last vampire or Mass Effect? Whoa, whoa! Blood Plus looks good. Blood the Last Vampire looks better than the Mass Effect movie, and that was made in the '90s. Really, I have to fucking see this because I felt like it's... nothing could get as bad as Blood Plus the Last Vampire. Like, like I it just felt okay. Like well, actually, animation. I'm gonna first correct you because Blood Plus and Blood the Last Vampire are two separate shows, and you're combining. That's what them. I mean. That's what I mean. Blood the Last Vampire. That's what I meant. Blood Plus like, is a completely yes, different Yes, 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 you're right. Like, what, what, what I felt about the Mass Effect anime was Funimation literally went to production IG, put this big, like, literally threw them a bunch, like, literally just, like, threw, like, a big pile of cash and goes, fucking do something with it. And, <laughs> and I think, production well, I- <laughs> now, I don't think, like, production IG isn't, like, infallible because they've, what? they've helped, no, like, they did, so- like, the Batman. <laughs> they did points whoa, in, whoa, in, whoa, in whoa. like, the Batman. <laughs> what, what, the, what the fuck is Holden <laughs> saying? <laughs> I don't know. He's like in. He's. I can't even understand him. He's just like noise. Yeah, right no. Now. He's like. He was yelling for help. I think, and he disappeared. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know. Hold it. Just disappeared. It's all good. I ended my sentence. Okay. Uh, continue, okay. Tristan. Sorry, Tristan. Go on. I just. I. Just, I don't even know where I was because Holden sounded like he was dying. So. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay, this sa- this shit sounds serious. Let's I, pay attention I, to I, this. I, I hope that's recorded so we can tell. Something, <laughs> something fucking just went down with holding guys. I really hope. He's- okay, wait, 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 wait. Okay, anyway, okay, keep going. Tristan. Yeah. Okay, so trying to figure out where I was. So, uh, um, yeah, Blood the Last Vampire yeah. was a hell of a lot better than whatever this was. There was like, there was no feeling to it there was nothing good about it the music that, wasn't that great the, the story so... i wait ca- what are you talking about mass effect mass effect mass i effect. was live i was live commentating in our skype chat to garant while watching this movie and i like called all the major plot points 10 minutes before they happened <laughs> it was so freaking predictable i was just like oh this guy uh he's gonna be he he's why do i have a feeling he, he has something to do with fucking cerberus and then Garn's just like he 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 he, and lo and behold, that's what happens. And no, then, no. and then the ending. Oh my oh, god! The, the en- oh my god! The ending. The thing. The thing that the ending. The thing that did it for me with the ending was I know that why they did the ending because they make it so fucking obvious when um oh, what's his name? What's the main character's name? Vega. Vega. When Vega shouts up, <laughs> it was my choice. I made the choice, and I was just like, "Really, Master? Really? <laughs> He's not <laughs> actually <laughs> talking to himself. He's talking to you, audience." <laughs> yes. uh, if we if we can just remind you, this is a Mass Effect game where <laughs> you make all your fucking choices, and it matters because that's what the ending did. Uh, so that's so to be cool. fair, though, the choice that they forced him into in that storyline. <laughs> I there was like no choice with the exception of possibly the final choices in Mass Effect 3. 
those bullshit things that have any that were ever given like even even the choice um with uh legion and dealing with uh the geth like that choice was even easier to do than whatever the hell they gave vega it was just like they yeah. gave him this impossible choice and no matter what he picked he couldn't win yeah, that's true. You, just, that's you couldn't true. win. Okay. <laughs> I feel like I need to... Welcome back, Holden. Or not. <laughs> Holden, are you there? Yeah. I, oh, there's Holden. I to... Holden, I hope you're okay. Yes. Oh, he's alive! He's alive! I had to... He's alive! I went and, I went and peed, too, because I had to. <laughs> Otherwise, my kidneys would explode. No no joke. I like, think. Like, I was, I was re- like, trying to figure out when I could sneakily go for a pee and no one would notice. <laughs> I don't like, think that's possible. <laughs> it's not gonna fucking happen. Uh, it's just like, okay, okay. We'll, like, just, take just, turns in the middle of the podcast. Just, okay, just, I'm just, out. Just, just, just wait for Holden to get one on if someone one is fucking long monologues. I'm gonna rush to the toilet and fucking rush back and no one's gonna fucking know. <laughs> it's like, okay, magic. I can do that. <sighs> it's magic. Okay. You know what I noticed recently, guys? I can do guys? that. What? So, Did you know? okay, what I've been watching um, Kuroko no Basuke, and I love it's, it. What's that? But Kuroko's basket? Yeah. Yes, oh, Kuroko's that. basketball. And that I'll, thing. Also, How? I've uh, caught up to Psychopaths and Robotics Notes, and I noticed that all of them are done by a project, uh, production IG. And I like okay. I never noticed like a production IG used to have kind of like the same animation style and and like character style yes, they and did. all that and i noticed like with these three mm-hmm. enemies yeah like they're getting so much more diverse now i don't like and, it yeah like it, it like blows my mind because production ig i, I love their old character designer like to, after guilty crown came to out, death. it seems like nothing like topped guilty crown in animation like like Ugh. once guilty crown came oh. out and it sucks okay what no wait wait back up what year did guilty crown come out guilty crown came out last this year 2011 2012 2012 what year did karano kyokai come out 2007 done uh karano kyokai is you folk table not production ig doesn't matter didn't you just no okay didn't yeah. you say that it was the best animation you'd seen N- no 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 i'm saying like with production ig like the best Anime, I feel like that production IG did. She means bo- from the company. Was Guilty Crown. Okay, hold. Garant, Holden, Guilty Crown, better than Standalone Complex or any Ghost in the Shell you've seen. Yes or no? Fucking, I haven't seen even seen Guilty Crown. I mean, I've seen one episode, but just, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's just like, like, because Ghost in the Shell was done in, what, 2006 or 2007? 2004. Like, 2004. 2004. Okay, so you're taking into consideration the time and how they did that earlier. No, in time. you don't take no, no. into consideration time when you talk about animation at all. You do not. Okay, but like I haven't seen Ghost in the Shell, so that doesn't count for me. Another fight, everyone! No, get, no, get, no, get, no, get, no, get, no, get no, no. What I'm saying <laughs> is that doesn't count because I haven't seen Ghost in the Shell, so for me. And I haven't seen Guilty Crown. Okay. So we can't have a proper fight. Okay, yet. so basically <laughs> what. I can fight. Okay. I'll fight. Let me do it. Let him fight. Let him what fight. are we fighting about? Hold in. Ghost in the Shell versus Ghost in the Shell versus Guilty Crown. When it comes to animation, dude. Oh, dude. Okay. So I saw this clip. Uh, I saw this thing from Ghost in the Shell yesterday, and it was they literally. You could see the shells ejecting from the gun, and the gun recoiled every time. And I was like, oh, what? And I was like, that's the coolest thing ever. I couldn't believe it. I don't know. They're they're two different beasts. I wouldn't really compare them. I'd say that Guilty Crown has the more... Okay, so while you guys talk it out, I'm watching a promotional video for Guilty Crown to check the animation. Okay, so you do that. But basically, like, what I'm saying is... Guilty Crown has higher res, I would say that. Guilty Crown has higher resolution. Okay. Okay, Gene, 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 Gene. Okay, uh, let me ask you. What's your your opinion on Kuroko no Baskets? Oh, my opinion? I love it so much. Is is it because of the fan service? No, not at Be all. Honest. No. Be no, honest. No, 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 Be no, no, honest. no, 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 no. Like, it's, it's, uh, like, it's, it's not that. It's, like, I don't even know how to explain it, man. Like, 
It's it's definitely not the muscles and like how everybody sculpted in the sweat. Okay. Oh 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 really? It's it's not that at all. It's like I love the connection that Kuroko and Taiga have, and like I love all the diverse personalities. It's it's it's, it's, it's the bromance which I put in the biggest inverted commas ever. The bromance. The bromance. It does have bromance. You know what? It, it reminds me so much of Chihara Furu. <laughs> So, that's why I like it. What? So much. It reminds me of Chihara Furu. In what way? Is because, it because it's a sport? No, that's why. Like because it's a sport, and you hear like everybody's inner monologues like is going on while they're playing the game. But Chihara Furu's heterosexual, not homosexual. Okay. I don't get it. Well, like. Whatever, either way. No, it's not. But I'm not gonna I, I, argue I, I with think, you what? because I like, don't get it. Always... I, I think I think I can explain this. Um scientifically. <laughs> it's just the amount the amount of estrogen both shows bring out for Gene, basically. I think girls <laughs> will like Kuroko's it... basket more than men, like, to be honest. No, like okay. I like Chi I wonder why. I like Chihara Furu because like it brings out like it brings out the art in the game and I love that. <laughs> Like poetics? <laughs> shut, shut the fuck up. I'm all about beauty. Shut the fuck up. I'm talking. And I don't see the beauty in it. Shut up. No. Like it, it's all about the poetics and the art and literature. Make me with, mom. Um with um Shihiro Furu. Um and Kurokono Basket is about physical strength and trying to get stronger and trying to like utilize your <sighs> skills and to become stronger. So I like it in that aspect, and in Chihara Furu, where they play karate, they're trying to be better at memorization, and they're trying to feel for the game more than, like, playing the game. And, like, I just see, like, th them both also giving the inner monologue. Like, it's just so interesting, and, like, that's how I see them together. Oh and the God. thing is, like, their animation looks, like, the same, too. Like, they're both, like, they both have a really light color palette. And so I was really amazed when I saw that production IG did Kuroko no Basuke because there's, I'm so used to see them doing like, like Holden said, like high resolution or like very high contrast animes, yep. like so with Psycho Pass and Guilty Crown and, um, like robotics I guess, notes. yeah, Robotics Notes, which I'm also watching too. And it's really I like really the green good. in that anime a lot. The, I like the green. The greens and blues are really nice. I okay, don't know why. but like it, like Kuroko no Basuke is definitely different because they also do like this weird neck shading thing. So I guess they really tried to take what was from the manga and put it into the they anime. Did. Yeah, they try like that. Yeah, they're trying really hard. That's probably like the one thing that really bugs me with Kuroko no Basuke <laughs> is like the shading. You don't like, like you the, don't like the neck shading. Yes, the the neck shading because like it, it, to, me, to me it, it it looks it can look. There was this one shot where it looked like this guy. They're all sculpted as like fuck, but like then they just have shading. It looked like this one guy. This one scene had like this really weird like gruff going on <laughs> on his neck. It, it just which looked one, like which one? I forgot. It's the the uh, the American dude. Okay, uh, Tiger. Yeah, Tiger. That's a fucking ho no American. I'm sorry. Whatever name his son Tiger. It's his last name. Uh, no, even so, no Americans are named Tiger. He should no, be named like, William. Like they did. And then his last name should be like. Oh no! I, no, I'll call him. I don't think um, he's American. I just think he was Japanese and lived in America. That's what I was assuming too, actually. Okay. But, but like. That's that explains his red but hair. I like it because they. Yeah, it's just all the character. Like he's a fucking. People in tiger. Japan look like he's anime. red. He's red like fire, <laughs> and his name is Taiga, and he's fierce. He's fierce. Can I, can I just say, what American has fucking red hair anyway? <laughs> like, no joke. Everyone at my college. Yeah. Whenever, 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 like, the Japanese, whenever the Japanese wants to, like, depict, it, like, the they, a foreigner, they always go for red, like... No, I, I would say that the, the biggest one... one remember in Sword of the Stranger? The biggest colors, I'll say, is, is blonde. blonde. It's, yeah. That is the foreigner look. It's, it's this guy's blonde. No, I was, I was remember, I was, I was remember Sword of the Stranger. Oh yeah, red hair. When uh, the main character had red hair. That was, I know, <laughs> but that was a plot element. That was really cool, actually, how they implemented that. But like, in what other anime has an American had red hair? Oh no, but he wasn't American. He he was European, I think. But he was a foreigner, no less. Well, it's I, may, may, maybe not like American, but like a foreigner. It is funny how okay. the foreigners in that, which were the two main guys, were blonde and had red hair. <laughs> that is actually really yeah. ironic. In Sword of the Stranger. It's a good movie. Too bad I haven't seen that. It's a really good Bones movie. But 
I'm I'm like so sad because I'm on episode 24 of Kurokono Basuke and I'm like, oh my god. And you want a season two, right? You want a season two? You got oh my god, it? yes I do. I'm. Oh my god. I'm picking up the manga after I finish episode 25 because like I just need to. It reads like, from right to left, by the way. That's how manga works. Okay, like I need to, <laughs> and there has to be a second season. If they give if they give a second season <sighs> to Chihiro Furu. Then they have to give a second season. No, too. no, that no, no, is no. no. A second season. No. A second no. season. No. No, a second season has been confirmed. Yes. So you don't need to worry about that. I was going to say, but that's, that's no. Uh, that association is ridiculous. If they gave it to Chihara Fu, they'll give it to it. That's ridiculous. But they need The to. shows that need it are like High School DxD. Like, thank God. No, shut the... F- thank Holden, you. shut Jesus. the fuck up right now. Thank Holden, thank- shut the fuck high, high, up. High School of the Dead needs it. Yes. High School of the, the Dead needs it so before bad. High School DxD. I can name... Too bad. Enough. Fucking getting it. I, I can name I can name like three fucking anime. Didn't okay, stop. Stop. That need mm-hmm. a second season. Didn't we already have this conversation? No. We like to do it a lot. What can I say? I could swear we did, because we were talking no. about how Batum needed a sequel. We were talking about how high school DXD needed a sequel. We were talking about how No 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 no. We weren't talking about Look at me, I'm Tristan, I'm a Nazi. No no no. We weren't talking about how DXD needed a sequel. We talked about how DXD has a second season and how I was surprised that it has a second season and how I was really upset that it has a second season. And what's We this- didn't talk about how high high school DXD was getting a second season. It's so good. Yeah, we did. <clears throat> or or we wanted it to get a second season, that's what I meant. We totally talked about this and Holden freaked the fuck out. Like we didn't Okay, we didn't talk about we didn't want to talk about high school DXD wanting a All it season. was was Holden was go- <clears throat> Holden was just like, yeah, high school DXD, I've got more wanky <laughs> material. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. was it, it has happened. But, uh, I will bet money that this has happened. Yeah. But why does it matter? It's okay. I mean, let us repeat it. Like, who gives a shit, Tristan? Like, it's all the same. Like, fucking, it's a podcast. Whatever. <laughs> but, like, I had this really interesting experience when I was reading the Croker in a Basket manga. You read it? I, I, read, I read a bit of it. And it was just... Oh, my God, that's awesome. And it was just like, I was, there was this moment where... Like because he's he's American. There's a moment where he speaks. Oh, he speaks English in actual English. That was so fucking weird. He speaks English in the manga. Yeah. And and I re- when I was when I was reading the panel, I couldn't not imagine him speaking really bad English. Yeah. And I don't know if I've just watched yeah. too much anime that I can't I can't imagine like, like any good English when I'm reading English. He's so cool. Yeah. Ingr- like, Son of a bitch. Like, like okay, <laughs> you like you guys read manga, except for Gene, but you guys read manga. Uh, yeah. Do 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 you have like an inner voice in your head when you like? Do you imagine like? Do you give a person a voice? Basically? I yes, of course, do. yes. We've talked about this. Yes, it helps if I've seen the show. In which case, I give them the voice that I. I read hear. one manga. We will talk about that momentarily, Gene. But keep that in mind. But 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 you know what? In Korokono Basuke... Tiger actually has an okay voice because there was that episode where he was trying to get the uh, sandwiches, lunch. and he was like, "This is Japanese lunch crush or that something." That was so like, fucking stupid. <laughs> this is Japanese time crush. I know, and what, he said yeah, it all right. I know what you're talking about, though. Yeah, yeah, but like, like what I don't like is like in Psychopath, the egoist. She's she's singing her like ending song and she's like, "You'll never walk alone." I'm like, "Oh my god, fucking get the words right." She's just like, Arr. like that gets me mad. Wait, was it the egotist? Yes, the egotist. Yeah, they're the singers. They're the. It was no the way. first opening, I think, in the first season and the ending. What? Yes, that's why I said the egotist do it. That psychopath reminds me so much of Guilty Crown because Guilty Crown and you just said psychopath, psychopath and Guilty Crown, Wait, like they're similar. They have the same openings. No, not the same openings, but like the egotist. No, no, same band. Yes, well, that's weird. I thought the egotist was made specifically for Guilty Crown because they. It was referencing the show. Uh, that's yes, that's what I thought too. That's weird. That is really weird. Yeah, like the group was the egotist that was like taking over. Because I was like the, the the yeah the group in the show was called the egotist. Exactly. That's what I thought too. But no, it's fucking like, crazy. So Psychopaths and Guilty Crown both have them, and then they're both made by Production IG, and like the animation's pretty similar. They're all super futuristic too. And then also it's all about like dystopia yeah. and trying to like fix the government. I like both of and, them. And like about yeah. what's moral and immoral. Yep. Yeah. So, like, it, it's really cool, but at the same time, like, I don't know how I got to this conversation, because I was talking about the egotists. No, I was wondering, like, that's a legitimate thing. I didn't know that the egotists were a band outside yeah. of Guilty Crown. That's really fucking weird. I did not know that's that. That's why... That I doesn't make sense. You know what's sense. really weird, too? 
That, like the opening theme to uh, the Psychopaths, the second season. Yes, guys, you need to watch it because it's it's so Cowboy Bebop. Seriously. Well, I would you say Cowboy Bebop opening. is so. Wait, 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 wait. I'd say Gunsmith Cats. I'd. Well, I'd say you haven't seen Cowboy Bebop, so how can you say that? Because I think I saw the opening to Cowboy Bebop. <laughs> I so, think. So. <laughs> the opening. Yes. So that's why I said the opening to Psychopaths is so Cowboy Bebop because it it's sort of like Cowboy Bebop's opening. <sighs> Seriously, check it out right now. All right. Well, well, I'm gonna watch Psychopaths anyway. But what, has he finished yet? No, no, no. no. It's yeah, going almost. to be really soon. It'll finish next well, week. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait for it to finish before I watch it. It'll, because, like, it'll finish next week. Because yeah, anything Ganerobuchi what uh, touches, yeah, I'm fucking watching it no matter what. <laughs> like, no, you should also check out Robotics Notes. Like at first, I thought Robotics Notes was gonna be, like, like the big three. I feel like from the fall was Blast of Tempest, Psychopath, and Robotics Notes. And I thought Robotics Notes was gonna be really corny. Just by the title, and I thought, right. okay, well, nothing can get us. Just good. by the title, I was like, hello, oh, yeah. Steins Gate. That's... Oh my god. Yep. I didn't think it was going to be Oh corn. my god, semicolon. <laughs> like, what the like, fuck, man? That's what I thought, too. And I was like, oh, it can't be as good as Steins Gate. But, like, I think out of the three, I'm definitely liking Robotics Notes the most. It's because it has the most episodes so far. Yeah. Really? It's weird because they're, yeah, they're, Psychopaths and it are both made by Production IG and they both have, like, 22 episodes. Exactly. That's what's so weird. They're working. They're working from. They're working really fucking hard. In fucking production energy. I know. It's that's what I thought. Like it's so weird. And fucking kill over and die soon. Because that is. They're both. They're not shitty animation. Neither of them are. No, 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 no. But that's why I also feel like nothing's been as good as Guilty Crown because production IG had Kuroko no, 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 no Basuke. Then it had. And then it had um, Psychopaths and it had Robotics Notes. Guilty Crown. Had- so it's like they had all that going on at once. Well, I think like- Guilty Crown definitely had its undivided attention for a long time. Uh, I mean, because they had, they had a Rocky yeah, directing that's for it, sure. the director of Death Note. Yeah, yeah. And they had all yeah. these, like, they they were just so satisfied with everything. And then, again, from a beauty standpoint and, like, sound and everything, it's like, again, from production standpoint, strictly, not story and characters. It's still, like, one of the best-looking sounding anime I've, like, ever seen. Like, the soundtrack's really fucking awesome. The animation's really fucking awesome. It's just a really cool-looking and sounding series, despite... Because it's just one big homage to, like, mechs and shows, but I've said that before. But no, like, I agree with Eugene. I think that production IGs really got their hands full, so I'm waiting for whenever they're just gonna... They're gonna chill out again, and they're gonna throw something fucking amazing out again. I think that they can totally do it. They've proved that they can. I feel like if... I feel like they should have put all their work into Psychopaths instead of... I do. I agree. Like, instead of Guilty Crown. That is, that is a very true thing. Yeah. That would have... I agree. Because that actually would have been a very yeah. legitimate thing. Because I think it is a better overall story. And they both were released very... Like, I think within one or two seasons of each other. I think that it would be true. Yeah. I mean, because I, f- yeah, I yeah. feel like with Robotics Notes, they did... Like, Robotics Notes, the way it's going now, is okay. Because it... It doesn't need that, like, it doesn't need that extra step of going overboard because it sort of has the same feel as Steins Gate. Because it's based in reality. Yeah, so I feel like... Well, it's because it's based in reality. I mean, yeah. with the so dystopian th- culture, you really have to sell it in the details. Because, I mean, the devil's in the details when you get into, like, anime like Cowboy Bebop and Ghost in the Shell. It's like, it's all the little things that really add up to the exactly. believable world that's presented. And in Robotics Notes, they don't really need that. So I feel like what they did with, with Robotics Notes is fine. But, like, if only... Only if they took what they had and go to kind of put in Psychopaths, Psychopaths could be amazing because, like, what what drives amazing. me amazing? No, amazing. Re- because, amazing, amazing, amazing. Like the thing that's the worst in Psychopaths is probably the character designs and like not really the plain character designs. But I agree. I totally agree. I I agree. It. No, the character designs look so fucking generic. They look so dumb. Do you know what I mean? The girl looks like she's stoned 24-7. Yeah. <laughs> the, like, the character designer, it's it's definitely... I know exactly what you're talking about because... The only one that looks good is the the guy with the robotic arm is the only one that looks good. Oh, I bet I know what it is. It, well, it yeah. just struck me that since Guilty Crown and Psychopaths are both IG, it makes sense that it's the egotists. I guess the egotists have a deal with IG. That would make sense. Maybe. But yeah. It's the fucking, yeah, the character designs for it are like, it's so shoujo, I guess I would say. 
Like yeah, the men are so handsome. It's like it's like you take and, the you take the characters from like Kurokono Basuke. It's fucking Sakamichi no pa- No, it's fucking Sakamichi no Palan. Yeah, with fucking yeah. Like the main, the, it's just all he needs is a fucking band aid on his nose, and he's fucking that guy. <laughs> and he's fucking the cut on his cheek and the band aid on. His oh my god! Oh, I want yeah. I want that fucking yeah. like it, I want that on my desk by tomorrow morning. If Psycho way, Pass had different character designs, or at least there's certain parts where they're just talking and they look so much less detailed uh, like and i look at it because usually i'm reading the subtitles so i'm not really paying attention to most of the animation i guess but it, it comes to the point where there's like I, i've learned to read faster so i can see the picture a bit more and i've noticed that like the character designs in psychopaths are so much less detailed in certain parts like they definitely put more effort into the fighting scenes and action scenes than when they're just talking about what's going on yeah. and their thoughts so, well, um, the thing about Art Production IG is that after they made Ghost in the Cell sound on Complex, that was their prime. Yeah, I guess. You know I, mean? I mean, I've never seen it, but I believe you guys. I agree. No, no, no. Well, well, Tr- Tris- well Tristan can back me up because Holden just pretends. Yeah, I mean, Tristan is boss. So. Hold- Hold- Holden-, Hold- Holden just pretends he sees it. Well, no, I can, like, yeah, <laughs> I can do that. Yeah, but, but, like that. Wait, that wait, was wait, their- wait, wait. That was, that was their prime. Yeah. Like, okay, like what? Like, because like Tristan said, they, were, they, were, they had this, there's this big pile of money. <laughs> And every studio has it at one point. Yeah, no, no, it's not a pile. It's like a vault. And it comes with a mystical, magical key that, like, <laughs> they put in their pocket and just disappears. Randomly. Yeah. So, okay, okay. Okay, so... So, since Ghost in the Shell, standalone complex, represents production IT's yes. prime. Mm-hmm. What do you think represents Bones' as prime? The show that represents Okay, prime? Uh, Bones is going to be Full Metal Alchemist. I was I was gonna say probably Brotherhood as well on top. Of I that. want to say their their absolute prime and it only got worse after that was Brotherhood because nothing really happened after that. It was just like yeah, oh, no. they really didn't do anything else. They kind of peaked. though if well, you they, really want to be like if you want to be a dick, you can say that Bones's prime was Bebop. <laughs> well, that would be sun. That would be a lot. That, that would be unconfirmed Bones, but yes, I guess that would be unconfirmed Bones. I would say that was Sunrise's prime. That was Sunrise's prime. Well. The, Actually, no, 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 no. Code Geass, Code, you reckon? No, I wouldn't no. say that, actually. I would say it was a long time ago. Code, no, no, Code Geass, Code, no, no, Code Geass was like them, was like a relapse. It's like someone finally got it in their head. Hey, you remember the good old days? Yeah, those were great. Let's try and recreate those. And the result was Code Geass. I don't think it was their prime. Speaking of shitty character designs, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, yay clamp. Speaking of shitty character designs. <laughs> oh, 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 shitty character designs and clamp. Yay right? clamp. Yay clamp and their let's have like nightmare before Christmas characters because why not? I fucking hate it. It's so bad. If they would have stuck with the normal fucking Gundam character designs, it would have made the series better. I can like guarantee. Fucking clamp. I will never forgive them. Never forget. Clamp hasn't been good since Angelic Clamp, Lair. I, 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 Clamp's never been good for me, to be fair. I liked Angelic Lair. And I'm okay with Chobits. There's not much I'm else. Just, it, it's, yeah, I'm just meh with Chobits. But uh, I, I'll be honest. Another character design I'm not a fan Uh-oh. of. Is, Here uh, we go. Type. Type. Moon. Dun, oh. dun, dun. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. I'm done. I'm leaving. And no, I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm fine. I'm, I'm fine with it. And shit just got real, and guys. Especially like if there's one thing, Tight Moon has the best designs. And it's the one thing I oh that that God. I reject about Karina Kyokai and Fate Zero is the character design. Fuck everything and everything you like. <laughs> Fuck you. You don't deserve Fate Zero. You don't deserve Karina Kyokai. Okay, but guys, but, guys, but, guys, but, guys, do you hear that? Do you hear that bomb but, but, dropping, guys? Do you hear that bomb dropping? I think I just heard it. Okay, but. But, but <laughs> you say that the character designs are bad, and you s- okay. So even though the designs are bad, the rendering and the creation of those designs is fucking, is fucking beautiful, wild. amazing. But that's what I'm saying. It can't work with any other character design. It, it is cannot. Beautiful. It just doesn't work. It only works with Type Moon because they're well rounded. Because they're literally symmetrically rounded characters. Everything is like smooth on them. It wouldn't work no, no. with like Clamp. I'll tell you. I'll tell you why I, I don't like the character designs. Clamp would look like a dirty Fuck can clamp. opener. Blood sea. Okay. Fuck <laughs> Clamp. Fuck. It's not about Clamp. We all hate. We all hate Clamp character designs because they look like fucking. Okay, if anybody <gasps> listening to our podcast likes the Clamp designs, please 
tell us because I need to know how many clamp lovers are out there so I can. She wants to kill you. Hate you. She wants to kill you. She's gonna find out where you live. No, I won't kill you, but. And she's going well, to go there. No, that depends. No, it's just whenever they're in context. Blood Plus? Just... Blood Plus was out of context. She's going to take you by the head. No, okay, it's all about the character designs and the context. Then, then I could sort of get it for Kyron and Kyrgyz, But the reason I don't like type moon designs, everyone looks so fucking soulless. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, okay. maybe that's the point. That's, mm. okay. What the, what? What part of the boundary of emptiness do you not understand? No, no, no. Like I said, like I said, it's okay for Karen no Kyokai. Like, I might reject That's it. That's what I said. It's all about the context. But, like, Fate Zero. Like, it's it's the fucking gradient eyes that I hate. But the fact that they, they, don't, they don't have pupils. Go fuck yourself. No, I feel like they have a difference, Garn. Go to hell. Garn. Momura Soda has shitty designs. I hate it. Garn, like the guy, the guy that... No, actually, they're pretty good. I like them. The bug man in Fate Zero. What was his name? The bug man, the uncle. He was like the only one out of all the characters that didn't have pupils and had that gradient that you're talking about, like in Karno Kyo Guy. All the other characters in Fate Zero had that. They didn't have the gradients that you're talking about. No, everyone, like I swear, everyone had the gradients. It's, the eyes always like gradient. <laughs> gradient. It's the best design out there. It is. I, it is beauty. That's the thing. That's like, even, so even right. My favorite character from Fate Zero was Ryder, <laughs> and even he had the you're gradient right. eyes. And the thing is, like I'm, I'm just very sensitive to this stuff. And I just like without any pupils or anything. Like they say, eyes are the soul, are the window to your soul, right? Yeah. And just, just it's just like looking at them. Everyone looks so, so soulless. That's like, the kinda... beauty of it. That's what I love about it, is that everyone looks like dolls. I love no, it. No, 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 we're Karen Ki- we're, we're no Kyokai. It's okay, because, you know, that, that's kind of the point. But we're, we're like Fate Zero. Not everyone should be like, not everyone should be like that. And nope, I would just... argue against it, and I shall. What about, like, f- what about, like, Fate of State Night? Like... Fate of State Night, I'm not going to even get into it. Uh... That, that's, just... that's Studio uh... Dean, that's totally different. The character designs are similar, it's but it's a lot eye. more jagged. What about that dragon guy? The dragon? The dragon? <laughs> Still better than JoJo's. The dragon. the dragon, guys! The dragon! That dragon was it's the shit. I'm gonna bend over now, we're gonna get fucked, so yeah. <laughs> Still better than JoJo's. The dragon is, like, way better than at least no, fucking okay. psychopath character designs. The thing about it is that it's all about it's about physical <laughs> roundness, and that's the thing, is that you can you can shade it really well, because if you were to apply it to a more jagged design, like Clamp, it wouldn't work. It looks really fucking weird. Okay, so hold it. Yeah. Hold it, I have a question for you. Mm-hmm. Besides Clamp, what character designs do you not like? Do I not like? Yes, besides Clamp. Uh, there's not many. It's it's only it's only whenever they're out of context. That's the biggest thing. Okay, Clamp so doesn't have necessarily one. bad designs, okay? Because Blood C and Kogius have bad designs because the designs don't complement the show. They complement stuff like Subasa and uh Ko- and Kobato and stuff and more uh whimsical stuff. They don't complement oh, so this is about vampires or this is about like killing my dad. It doesn't really complement that, that all too well. Bad designs though? I would say that there's some designs that annoy me, that but they're not bad. Okay, so I, I learned to accept everything. So what annoys you? Um, stuff that annoys me is hairstyles that look really, really similar to another hairstyle in the show. I don't know why, but it just annoys me. It's just little things. I can't like. There's no real like particular show where I'm just like everyone in the show. Okay. Fucking get your hair done or something. I ha- I have one where I hated okay. all of the character designs. Maybe maybe no, I just go, can't go. think. Yeah, yeah so let's hear. Let's hear. Okay. X X X Holic. That's, that's clamp. That's clamp. Oh, it is clamp. So. Fuck, you're right. Ah. Shit. <laughs> 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 oh my God. It's fucking clamp. <laughs> and, and we fucking anticipated that. And you, you, you had your chance to impress us. And what did you do? I <laughs> fucked up as always. Yes. Screw the pooch. Fucking gene fail. Gene fail. That's like that's a thing. That's a thing now. Make that a Gene thing. Fa- Gene fail. It, no, 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 no. It's- Gene fail is now like every time, <laughs> every time someone does something stupid, you shout out Gene fail. Gene fail. That's the new Gene term. Fail. Gene fail. For fucking up. Damn it! I thought I was <laughs> on a roll. No, 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 no. Like on a personal level, when I first met Gene, I remember like one of the first things you did was try to send me a fucking word document. 
And okay. because you, 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 you were trying to figure out how you fucked up a Word document. Right. Okay. And, then, and then what happens was she couldn't send me it. So she sent me like a picture. And on the picture, okay. it was just these, these, red, these red scribbles where she tried to do something. <laughs> Oh shit! And it was just—it was just a word document. Wait, wait, was this I was this a printed I... script or something? Was, was this a hard copy? No, 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 no. It was a screenshot. It was a screenshot of her, of like <laughs> MS Paint. Of, no, yeah, yeah. It was like MS Paint or something. It was like MS Paint scribbles <laughs> on a screenshot of her Microsoft Word document. Are you sure? I was trying to send you a script, but I remember—I remember the red squiggles. <laughs> But I don't mm. remember what I was trying to send you. Oh my god! <laughs> since, since like me and Garten meant that like that's been a thing. He's been saying like Gene fail every time I did something stupid. But I remember that one. But I don't think I was sending you a script. Uh, you, you were sending me a script because you, you like <laughs> you, you couldn't figure out how you fucked up words so badly that you displayed your script incorrectly. So you were just scribbling somehow on MS Paint on your script, and you thought it would fucking work somehow if you just if you just scribbled like red paint on it that it would somehow make your script readable but is- that is true i do that that is a I thing so, like i so remember that oh my god I mean, it's just like this moment where gene goes up to me just like go on go on can you help me with this like i, I can't figure this problem out and then i just open it i'm just like gene what what the fuck did you just fucking send me you just vomit on your paper or something <laughs> <Yeah>. oh god <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, that, 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 that was just a random tangent. How there long? you go. So more people can make fun of me. There you go, guys. Oh, yeah. G- G- Gene Fail is now an official saying. It is. Every time you do something stupid, it's Gene Fail. <sighs> like like holding <laughs> screaming earlier and disappearing? Gene Fail. <laughs> it, it, I didn't stop screaming. That's the thing. <laughs> That's the beauty of it. I'm just... I don't know. That was so weird. <laughs> like, it was just like... It happens. Like, you're fading away and it's like... We didn't know what the fuck you were saying. I knew what I was saying, and I knew you guys didn't know what I was saying, so I just said it anyway. Or do you know what you're saying? I think I do. And maybe we knew what you were saying, but you didn't know what you were saying, thus creating a singularity of not knowing what the other one was saying. So much All so... Right, Tristan, Tristan, you're getting too smart right now. Wait, 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 we're saying wait so much in this episode. I'm just going to point wait. that out. Totomate kudasai. Totomate. Totomate? Totomate. Oh my god. The, 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 my immediate thought with that is that someone is walking out of like the room or something. And it's just someone's getting up, standing up, and it's like, they like, spill their coffee because they're like, What the fuck, son? You can't get fucking get out of my house. It's <laughs> Dude, I, I, know, I have this vivid scene of just this man drinking his coffee and his wife walks out and he just drops his coffee and he's burning his lap. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you thinking of that? Oh it's like whenever we, whenever we hear Chota, I, just, I think of it as like Phoenix Wright moment where they're pointing at it, it's like Chota Mate! <laughs> Instead of like, hold it! Chota Mate! Yeah. <laughs> that is like the oh. coolest term ever. Besides Onicha? Uh, no, God, how can Besides that and Onicha? No, I I knew you were gonna fucking say that. Like, I knew... can we go through one, Onichan. just one podcast? Onicha. I I vote in our democratic Onichan. alliance that we guys, mute guys, Jean. guys, guys, yes, guys. Yes, Next what time this happened. Why the fuck did we make her host? <laughs> <laughs> of the call, I didn't know less. <laughs> like, she's the only one we can't kick from this call. She's not host of this of this podcast, I would like to point out. We are an equal opportunity lender where Holden is the host. Um, okay. So, <laughs> so host oh, then. Man. Do your hostly yep. duties. Yeah, I have, how long have we been recording? Maybe taking the Too host. Too long. We've been Too recording long. for quite a while. Why don't we take this and hostly deed long. and take us out of the podcast, yeah, Holden? I, I, th- I can I can drink to that. that. Okay. I have one thing to say it's to that. Good for you. <gasps> feel yeah, why well, didn't everybody yeah, else? I feel it too. Never mind. What the fuck is Tristan doing? Like, come back. What the fuck is Gene doing? Jiggly. <laughs> 
I love the fact that this actually starts off as a legitimate podcast with like <laughs> actual discussions, and now it's just. I think I broke it. <laughs> and then now it's literally just. This is what the alcohol has done. Talking shit. This is this is like we've been drinking. Kids, don't drink and talk on podcasts. <laughs> you say dumb shit. Kids, kids, <laughs> li- listen, listen, li- li- shut the fuck up. <laughs> My bad. Like, okay, kids, take it from us. Don't drink and podcast. It's dangerous. Don't drink and drive either. Only uh, you fu- can stop forest fires. Yeah. You are the chosen one. With that said, I would like to close this episode of Potaku. Thank you for listening. I am Holden from Holden Reviews. Or are you? Good night and a happy late St. Patrick's Day, everyone. Yay! What if you're not Holden? Let's get fucking hammered! And then Woo! I'm Let's get hammered. Genie. Also known as X Disturb Jeans, and until next time, yeah. Wait, Jiggly so pop. you have you have disturbed jeans? What made these jeans disturbed? I think oh, I think we can talk about this. Like I never oh, heard guys, that no, no, one no, no, before. Guys, 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 oh. guys, guys. Okay, one thing, two things I have to mention. One, I completely forgot this, but we have a Twitter now. <coughs> oh yes. So oh we, shit. Yeah. I don't know how we forgot about that for the entire fucking podcast. Oh my god. Follow us on Twitter if you guys want to know when we have our podcast out. And you know, we're not going to actually put anything interesting on Twitter. It's just going to be, "Hey, we made a new episode. Maybe you want to check it out." I might put funny yeah. qu- I might put funny comments cuz we get some of those. Yeah, I might uh, I like them. Yeah. I may troll Pataku once in a while. Yeah, so um so follow us on Twitter at at Podtaku, <clears throat> obvious fucking obvious, obvious. fucking just <laughs> so obvious. Obvious name is obvious. The second thing is, we are trying to think of a decent review name for, for Jean. Jean's yep. review. Oh yes. yes, because at the moment it's hi, this is Jean from X Disturbed Jeans, which if you can't tell, sounds fucking stupid. Pretty fucking shit. <laughs> it's shit. <laughs> it's shit. It's shit. So. So we, we have been racking it's our brains shit. trying to think up a good name for Gene. So if good. you have any suggestions for that, please put it in the comment section as well because we don't have a question to ask in this podcast because there's literally Yeah, so shit. guys, so- <laughs> try to find my <laughs> new name. And hey, maybe if you guys come up with a good one, I will use yours. And you will have credit forever. And that would be awesome. Because I can't think I of anything. I shall suck your dick! No. Oh, 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 so funny. <laughs> You've heard it here. You heard it here. <laughs> you heard it here first, even though I would never do that. But okay. Well, obviously, because you're on the internet. But <laughs> if they met you in real life, you can't owe them. What the fuck? You can't, you can't. What the fuck? What the fuck? No, okay, end the podcast. No. no, no, no! I want to say hello to my mom. We haven't done the we haven't done the second half. Hi, mom. <laughs> we haven't done the second half of the outro yet. We only got halfway through. I know. We the only did get we got two people down. Jeez, so guard, fucking say something. I already fucking went. It's like you're no, not, not Gene, not you, Gene. I think he said jeez. Jeez. Gene fail. He said jeez. Gene fail. Gene fail. Gene fail. Garin, say you're leaving now. I have to pee so bad. <laughs> no, no shit. I got to pee. Too. Okay, hold on. Why do you, why do you go pee? And, um, no, why don't you end it and then... Oh so- my god, fucking end this shit! Because I have to freaking press stop recording. Fucking say something. And oh uh, this has been... Gig. Oh my god, I'm going to fucking kill you! <laughs> <laughs> and it's been getting off on the enemy's own. I'm picking up my reviewing, t- reviewing pace now, so... Um, I will see you all next time! Stay frosty, everyone. Oh, what are you going to do, Tristan? What are you going to do? <laughs> oh, my God. And he's choking. The pee is coming out. Oh <laughs> Tristan is not poised anymore. Tristan is no longer poised. Holy shit. <laughs> Let yeah. me stop recording. Please. Tristan has so, become barbaric. Uh, this, is, uh, this is me from my room. And uh, I will see you next time. He's fucking frosty. Stay frosty. He said, hells yeah. He said with a poised. That was such a poised. He's so fucking chill. He's so fucking poised. He's so fucking frosty. I said with a poised look and my freaking mug with dragons on it. Dragon dildos. What about dragon dildos? Uh, I have dragons on this mug. It's like a chalice. A chalice of frosty awesomeness. And nobody can top it. I dare you to try. Go. Dragon dildos. And it has Go the, now. 
Run! Uh, Fly, you fools! Okay, let, 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 hold and go, but before before we go. Okay, guys, and until next time, I see you all next time, and I hope you enjoyed this podcast. And Why the hell does Gene get the last word? Yes, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this podcast. Happy late St. Patrick's Day. And with that, Happy, bye. like, please, please do not, like, bye. think we're shit reviewers now. Yeah. We are very drunk. Garant, let's be honest. Like, I hope you guys really enjoyed this, seriously. Let's be honest. Nothing we've said in this podcast. Oh my god, shut up, everyone. I have to pee. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Nothing All we right. said in this podcast okay. will ruin right. our credibility more right. than we've already ruined it. Three, two, one. I'm peeing right now. No, no, three, two, one. No, three, two, one. Screw that. I'm done. Son, we're gonna start. We're gonna stop each. when I say we're gonna stop. I'm stopping now. now. So bye. Bye. Three, two, one. Go. Whatever. It's me, Mario.